Atomics. I cannot love her no skeezer. That is a dub I don't need her. I hit her once and I leave her. Blow on my phone for no reason. I cheated on you with a dancer. Okay, I surrender my hands up. At least I admit it, I'm in love. I do not have all the answers. And I gotta stay with the 90s days. Bitches that get niggas lying these days. Yo, what's good? It's your boy Key Sticks. Today, I have the best build video ever, bro. And I know I say this every time. You probably hear this all the time. But I'm telling you guys today, if you guys make this build and you don't like it, bro, just unsubscribe. Don't actually unsubscribe. But I promise, bro, this is the best, most overpowered build in NBA 2K22. I have like 15,000 games played, bro. I could tell you which is the best build. This is him, bro. This is him. Now, this build is 6-5. The bad spread is 12, 18, 16, and 6, which is... Not that good on defense, but six five and a half with max wingspan. You're actually six five and a half with max wingspan. You can see I'm put a little email right here so we can get the intro. But chat, I'm telling you, this is the best build. It's an offensive juggernaut. It's Hall of Fame shooting, Hall of Fame finishing, gold playmaking, which you're gonna see is way more than enough. And defense is just good enough. The height and the arm span makes up for the lack of badges. This is all around the best build. Now, since making this build, it has been very, very hard for me to lose, bro. You're gonna see I literally have like a 96 win percentage. I'm going to show you guys like the stats of the build, everything. It is everything right where you would want it. Like I said, the defense is the only little sus part, but you're so big that like if you play twos, even ones, I do not lose, bro. Like the defense is good enough for you not to lose because you don't turn the ball over. This build is crazy. You can see my record right here, bro. Like I'm not lying, bro. I do not lose. Now the key to this build is being able to dribble with uh, gold dribble moves you're gonna see in most of the clips i'm a decent dribbler so i make it work anybody who's a decent dribbler and you make this build bro you will be unbeatable it's unguardable if you can dribble a little bit all you have to do is play a slight bit of defense and you will not lose bro i'm telling you like yes i'm a good player but my record would never look like that without this build now i'm gonna show you the best animations to use with this so i i just switched to set shot 25 call me whatever you want i don't care long athlete layup those are the only two dunks you want and then those are my playmaking moves those are the only animations that you want make sure to equip the contact dunks but yeah those are all the animations let's get right into the build video so first things first you're gonna want to go shooting guard shooting guard is way more superior than point guard this year if you didn't know that already you should bro always make a shooting guard you get rim protector all that now for the pie chart i really like the blue and green pie chart just because you get hall of fame sniper hall of fame limitless those are the two most two of the most broken badges in the game um, I really like having them both and having them both Hall of Fame categories. Then I also went with the speed pie chart. And then I'm, you're going to copy these stats that I have right here. A couple key stats that I want to point out to you guys is that you will not get contact dunks until 98 overall. And you will not get pro dribble moves until 99 overall. Now on this build, it is very easy to keep 99. I'm telling you, you will not lose. However, before 99, you will not have contact dunks or pro dribble moves. But it does not mean the build will not be good because I went on a 50 game at a 92 overall. Like this build is just de demonized, but I just wanted to tell you guys that there are the stats. You guys got to copy them down. There's the badge count, which is very good. If you're a legend, put them all on defense. You will never, ever lose. Like, actually, um, but yeah, that's it for the stats. Body shape, I always go compact for no reason. 1.97 meters, which is 6.5 and a half, actually, if you translate it to feet, which is very, very big for a guard, especially with pro drill moves. 81 kilograms for the weight that's the perfect um that's the perfect uh point wingspan of course you are going to max this out that is the most important step probably in the whole thing is to max out the wingspan then of course of course if you know me choose play take that's always what i do just makes the game fun for me and you're going to build a catfish slasher ww build now i'm gonna show you guys i usually don't do this actually but i'm gonna show you guys like a full game of really how i work and how i use this build and watching this just think about how you would guard this so you can see i'm dribbling i'm a good dribbler i can obviously dunk from the free throw line look your only chance to guard this build is to hope i miss like i'm not i'm not trying to be cocky it, that's how i would guard this build that's the only way you can guard it like if somebody is a good dribbler on this build you can see you see what i'm doing i'm a decent dribbler i can get open as long as you can get open the slightest bit bro it's easy just hold square you're gonna make a white or you're gonna dunk it bro you can see me i'm going to work i'm just rim running shooting whatever bro it's too easy this build is too easy um i would recommend this build to anybody but that is going to wrap it up for the video. If you guys did enjoy, please don't forget to drop a like and subscribe. If you did uh, enjoy the build or you're going to make it, please let me know. I, I really enjoyed to hear that. 
But yeah, hope you guys have a good rest of your day, rest of whatever. Keep grinding, everybody. I love y'all. I'm out.